morning, it's Nola. I'm back with another oopsie. Yep, I went back to town and did some uh, thrifting, unfortunately. But this time it was different. I went in and I really wasn't looking for anything because I obviously have enough. Um, I always pick up doilies because I always think you guys need them. So I, what I have to do is get them up on here so that you can get them in your little hands. And, uh, but I did find a few things that mostly fabric this time. It was somebody who was a quilter must have, uh, decided that they weren't going to do it anymore or something. So anyway, here goes, I'll show you some of the, uh, the doilies. Oh, this first one, this is just a tablecloth I'm taking apart. So I will have those doilies as well. Now, just happen to be on top. Anyhow, here's one of the doilies this has a beautiful blue edge on it but other than that it's all all white and i think it's very pretty so there was that one and then there was this one and this one is gorgeous i normally don't buy these big ones but this one was in such beautiful shape it was four dollars for me to buy it mind you um but it's all pressed and starched and beautiful and you know it wasn't that colorful so I thought it was okay somebody might want it then I found this one with these big roses on it and then it's sort of like this so there's that one this one I loved I thought it was so dainty and so pretty. This one is going into my hoard vault. This is definitely one I'm going to keep. Then this um, pillow sham was there, which I thought was very pretty, very sparkly. Never been used, so. Somebody didn't like that. Then there was um, Battenberg. This is a uh, Valance. Brand new. Never been used. Still got the tags on it. So there was that as well. And I found this box. These are good containers to use anyway. has a nice secure lid on it. Um, then it came with all these things inside. It's got little sparkly hearts and, oh, what else is in here? Those are all hearts. And this one we've got snowmen and ice cream cones and so on. And then there was a package of flowers with just one missing and another package of flowers and a whole bunch of these type of daisies and and this one and this one there was a little tiny doily this brooch and these we can buy these in our fabric stores which you can see this one was $5.99 now that's more than I paid for this whole thing, but good for me. And then there's these. I've had some of these before. They're really neat, and they have stickers on the back. Um, another little tiny doily. Another brooch. Um, there's some buttons that Michael's had with the crocheting on them and one of these buttons and then there's some cupcakes so I thought this was a really good deal so I'm happy with that and then I also found, well, my husband found this one in the seniors thrift store. 
it doesn't have anything in it but it's nice and secure nice and deep so that'll be good for keeping little things in this was a bag That's it. This was a bag of lace, and they're all pieces, but they're nice pieces, so they're, um, you know, works for me, yellow, or pink and white, and then there was some white. Add some more white. And some green and gold and white. Teeny bit of yellow. Another little bit of a double white. Some peach. And more white. And this one, which I thought was really interesting. Never seen, I don't think I've seen this type before. And, oh, there was a green one in there. And another little piece of white. So that bag was under $2, $1.99, $1 and then a discount. So that was okay. Then I found some more doilies. This was another one that I found. Pink and white. So, um, and then I found fabric, like I said. Now, these bundles of fabric up here, these ones, you know, can run anywhere from uh, $60, $80, whatever. This one, was $5.99 and then I had a discount. So did I want it? Oh yeah. Thrilled to bits. And this one and these packages were oh, I believe the packages were three three fifty. I don't know, I took all the tags off. Three ninety nine on some. So there was this one, and it's got all these colors. And most of these fabrics are batiks, which I love batiks. And they're more expensive than the regular stuff. And then this was about four packages, I guess. But look at the colors I got in this. And I mean, you can see there's still paper on them, so they're, they've never even been washed. Beautiful batiks. I suppose if you're not into fabric, this is not a big thrill for you, but I am also a quilter, so this is very exciting. I mean, Annie, what do you think of this? What a score, huh? Wow. You just don't find these kind of deals every day. Love fabric. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. I don't think all of these are full quarters, but most of them are. Most of them have never even been unraveled, so. And there's another one, and another one.
And like I said, I left a few packages there, probably four or five because they were dark. And I have, most of my fat quarters are dark because I had a tendency to lean towards darker fabrics before. And now, of course, I like lighter fabrics. So there you go. So that filled in a lot of my light stuff. Then I found this piece of um, silk. And it was that beautiful light mauve color. So and it, that was only $1.99. So I thought that was a score and a half. So then I also found this outfit when I was in the um, seniors. Now there's no discount in the seniors, but they did have a discount on the dresses. So any dresses that had a red line were marked half price. So I picked this up, went up for $3, and I cut the sleeves off last night and the trim around the edge and then the bottom trim it's like so and then the dress itself is linen so I mean linen I can use linen no problem so I was really happy with that as well and that was I think I paid three dollars for that so basically that was it um that's all I found at the oopsie, but that's plenty. <laughs> so I am bound and determined now to get some of these things up. Now I have this uh, tablecloth, and it's it's the pineapple one. And it's white. It's got some stain on it. It's very hard to find, but it does have some discoloration. But I don't want to cut this up. It's just, it's a, it's a heavier um, uh, thread or like wool. It's more like a fortrell, I think. And these actually shapes look more like hearts. Um, but anyway, it would fit a big round table and it would look lovely. So... I paid $4.99 for it. So if anybody wants this for $4.99 and pays the shipping, it's yours. So it's, you know, it's a big tablecloth for a round table. So just let me know if you want it. It will be yours. You just have to pay me on PayPal. So other than that, I have... Um, just been trying to organize stuff and get some of these uh, laces together for some friends and um, I haven't kept up on anything. I've been really bad. I just realized that a couple of people are even having um, contests now or challenges so I don't know if I'm going to get involved or not but uh, I will do the best I can. And uh, I did get my snippet roll from Christine Harris, but I thought I'd put it together before I showed it to you guys. It's The pieces are lovely. Everybody did such an amazing job. So um, that's about it. So I may be back with some things for sale. So keep your eyes open and... Uh, Thank you for watching. Thank you to all my subbies. You guys are amazing. I love all of you. So, um, new subbies, old subbies, everybody. You guys are amazing. I, I don't know what I'd do without this now. It's my sole source of entertainment. So, um, thank you guys for that. But, um, at any rate, I will be back later, hopefully. So take care and have a wonderful day, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye now.